Health officials, employers and universities are all strongly encouraging people to get vaccinated. But can they also require it? In a growing number of circumstances, experts say the answer is yes. With most states dropping COVID restrictions, the push to get vaccinated is increasing. Some businesses, including Morgan Stanley, are requiring it for people to go back to the office. In December, the Equal Opportunity Employment Commission determined that is legal, as long as there are exceptions for medical and religious reasons. There is also legal precedent for states to require people to get vaccinated. In 1905, Cambridge, Massachusetts, fined people who refused to get the smallpox shot. A pastor sued, but the court said a community had the right to protect itself against an epidemic of disease. That's what the city of San Francisco says it's doing. It's 35,000 city employees will be required to be fully vaccinated or face termination. More than 500 colleges and universities are also requiring students to get vaccinated before they head back to class. Indiana University is one of them. Eight students from IU are suing. They're being stripped of their constitutional rights to uh, make medical treatment decisions for themselves. An IU spokesperson says the university is confident it will prevail. Houston Methodist Hospital already did after a judge dismissed a similar lawsuit brought by employees. 153 hospital employees resigned or were fired for refusing to get vaccinated. The employees have appealed the judge's decision. The Cambridge, Massachusetts case back in 1905 went all the way to the Supreme Court, but it took three years to get there and ultimately be decided. More vaccine mandates are expected once the vaccines receive full FDA approval, and that is expected for Pfizer and Moderna in a few months.